Alyssa, um, I'm from Flagstaff Hill and Sturt SES unit. I've been in the SES for just over a year. Uh, well, there's a few things really. My sister used to do it at Norlunga and I used to watch her run off to jobs and stuff like that. And I was intrigued but not interested enough because my life was doing something different. So when that all changed, I had an opportunity to join and I wanted new experiences and new people to meet and also life skills and all that sort of stuff. The courses have been really good. I've been able to do like drive vehicles operationally. Um, this one here that we're doing, Chainsaw, and uh, a bunch of other ones that have been really interesting. Mm -hmm. And learning things that you don't usually know, like swift water. I did the land-based swift water. And uh, that was really quite like, eye-opening because you don't really realise where drains are and what the problems could be and how dangerous they are. So that's a real eye-opener. Mm -hmm. um, and obviously you don't think about flooding because generally you're in a house or away from it. I've enjoyed meeting new people and I've really enjoyed just evolving as a person. Yeah. You know, I've got skills that I wouldn't necessarily have, just tying ropes, you know, a bit out of tie off a trailer without having to get dad to come around and help me. That's a huge thing and I know that some people will just know that, um, but for me it was something I had to learn. Okay, so SES is more about teamwork and providing um, assistance to people who might be injured or need rescuing, so things like storm, storm damage, um, trees down, like, you know, trees on a roof, trees on a house, trees on a roadway, just making things safe and, um, and then go into, there's a lot more other aspects to it, but mainly we are rescue and storm damage.